I'm done with my makeup. I'm going out in a while. I have a meeting, a business meeting, so wish me luck, guys. Wearing my Cartier ring, Cartier love bracelet. I am wearing a combination of black and white outfit. Just a simple white long sleeves with black and white tweed pipings. And of course, a matching skirt. For my bag, I'm wearing my Chanel classic flap. And for my shoes, this Ferragamo black pumps. hello everyone welcome back to my channel it's too early yet to leave the house for my appointment this afternoon so i thought of making this video because i still have time and yes today i want to talk about a jewelry piece in my collection which is the herringbone chain necklace if you're interested in how this piece should be worn cared for whether you should buy one or not my thoughts and opinion about it then this video is for you So, what is a herringbone chain? A herringbone or flat chain is a type of necklace made up of thin flat metal segments. They're not straight but bent in the middle forming a herringbone pattern and let me show you up close my personal herringbone chain necklace or we call it flat chain here. Uh, I purchased before. It's an 18 carat solid Japan yellow gold in the size 4mm. It's not really thick but not too dainty. The weight is 8.30 grams and the length is 16 to 18 inches meaning adjustable. This is what the back looks like. This is adjustable like I mentioned and it, it has a charm a tiny little heart which is really really cute can you see how shiny is that it's really really sparkly i've worn it in the lowest setting which is 16 inches It's beautiful, right? I like to wear it this way in the lowest setting like a choker. Do I love it? Yes, of course. Do I recommend it? Well, first, let's talk about pros and cons. This chain is a traditional uh, chain style that has been popular for many years. It is an ultimate choice for a classic and unique chain style that is both trendy and stylish. It is still popular today and what makes this chain really nice and special is that it never goes out of style. You can wear it alone or layer with other pieces and it will really look amazing no matter what the occasion is. You can dress it up, dress it down, whatever you choose to wear in it, it will look like a statement piece and a great wardrobe staple if you are looking for a simple stylish necklace that will add glitz and glam to your special event and what i also like about this chain type is its smooth texture it feels luxurious it always clings nicely to the contours of your body so it stays around your neck without flipping over or bending unlike other necklaces wherein you need to adjust each time to make sure they stay in place right so another pro for this piece is it is flawlessly crafted and polished you can see how beautiful the detail is and the luster it shines perfectly even when worn alone that is exactly the main reason why we are attracted to jewelry another pro that i can think about this necklace is it is unisex yes men and women can wear this anytime anywhere with any outfit so that's a big plus for this uh, chain type now for the cons of this chain type one of the biggest problems with this chain is that it kinks very easily since the chain segments are both flat and thin if you pull the necklace a bit harder it can bend it can also get caught with certain types of clothing which will twist the chain so you should be careful of what to wear another cone is since these necklaces are very fragile, adding pendants can damage them. Any weight that pulls them down can bend them. I would not suggest you put pendant on, but if you can't resist, make sure that it is as light as possible or pendants with wider loop or clasp 
is specifically designed for flat chains. Herringbone chains are very vulnerable, so if you are someone who doesn't like to take off jewelry when at the gym or when taking a shower, this chain is not for you. The reason being is you might accidentally pull it, causing it to bend. I really can't focus because I hear someone cooking in the kitchen. I can hear it that far, you know. Anyway, a major con is that you can't sleep with your flat chain, so you cannot sleep with it. It's very easy to get it kink when you turn over in bed, and once you damage it, well, you can have it repaired, of course, but the chain may never look the same. If the chain is just bent, it can be straightened out or flattened, but the twisted part will remain a weak spot, causing it to break after some time. So now let's go back to the original question. Will I recommend it? As you have already known, wearing a herringbone chain is a delicate thing. It won't probably last a lifetime, so it all depends on your lifestyle. If you think you can handle this type of necklace with care, then go ahead. It is such a beautiful statement piece, not really a good investment in some point, especially if you damage it. And that's the reason why I don't wear it regularly. It's a, not an everyday jewelry, but I really, really love it. It can be worn casual or formal. That's how versatile it is. Very classy, timeless, and simple. You wouldn't go wrong with this chain type even in this day on chains. Just make sure you buy ones that are made of high quality and durable materials like this one. I'm going to show you an example of my, um, I think this is a flat chain snake type. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong. And I'm not really sure if this is considered as herringbone, but the chain looks the same. And this one is in 18 karat yellow gold. It has been with me since 2000. That's how old this necklace is. It also has a pair of earrings. I still love it and I still use this together with the earrings. So you may start with this chain type before going for the herringbone. Anyway, if you still love the herringbone chain and you know how to take care of them because repairing is a huge hassle and any fix will have limited success. So that's all for now. I hope you find this topic helpful. Please subscribe if you haven't done so and turn that bell on for new videos. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I'll see you on my next one. Bye.